So you got Goofy, and you got the fishing rod, but how do you get them fish? I'm Jamie Latour, and I'm going to show you how to catch fish in the world of Disney Dreamlight Valley. Fishing can be a good way to earn money and find food in Disney Dreamlight Valley. To get the fishing rod, you first need to find Goofy. We recently posted a video on unlocking this dippy dog on the channel, and you can check that out along with the written guide in the links in the description below. With the fishing rod and, unfortunately, Goofy in tow, you can now go to any source of water and look for these rippling, bubbling circles. Fishing is actually pretty straightforward compared to other games. You select your rod from the tool wheel, cast your line inside of the circle, and then press A when prompted. The circle will then turn green. Each time that happens, hit A again and again until you catch a fish. If you mess up, don't worry, you just need to recast your line inside of the circle. The color of the circle determines the value and rarity of the fish that you can catch, as well as how hard it will be to catch that fish. White circles are typically the easiest and give the most common fish. Blue circles give you rarer fish, but it's a little harder to catch them. And gold circles are the hardest of all, but give you the best fish. If you cast your line in water where there is no circle at all, you'll either catch a basic boring fish like a cod or some seaweed. As of right now, there are 24 kinds of fish that you can catch. But since this game is still in early development, that number may change. I've got the full list of fish right here on the screen. And to get a better look at it, you can go to our written guide on the Gamer website, and that will show you where to catch these fish, how many star coins they're worth, and how much energy they'll give you when eaten. The link for that will be in the description below as well. You can also get some of this information from the collection section of your menu. One last fishing tip involves unlocking Moana and her fishing boat. After you get rid of all the thorns in front of the Dream Castle, you'll have the option to open up one of three doors that lead to other realms. If you want to find Moana, choose the Ocean with a Demigod option. If you choose one of the other options, you can still get to Moana's realm, but you'll need to earn an additional 3,000 Dream Light to do so. And that will be quite the grind. Once you get to Moana's realm, you'll have to do a few quests for her, as well as a quick quest for Maui, who is definitely not being voiced by Dwayne The Rock Johnson. After you finish up her side quest, you'll get the option to build her a house in the valley. She'll want her home close to the ocean, which means you'll need to place it in Dazzle Beach. But to get to that biome, you'll need to go through the Friendship is Everything quest to get the option to remove the thorns in front of Dazzle Beach, which involves hitting Friendship level 5 with three of your friends. God, you gotta do things on top of things on top of things to get things done in this game. Once you've given out a bunch of gifts and hung out with... Uh, goofy. <sighs> You'll be able to spend 1,000 Dreamlight to open up the path to Dazzle Beach and place Moana's house. She'll then move into the valley to be your friend. From here, you can eventually unlock the quest to fix up her fishing boat, which will require you to gather all of this crap, and then hand it all over to Moana. Once you have all of that, she'll fix the fishing boat, and she'll be able to go out into the ocean and catch fish for you. You can also upgrade the fishing boat, which will allow Moana to catch you better, rarer fish more efficiently. It'll also mean that to get fish, you'll no longer have to go fishing with Goofy quite as much, and you can't put a price on that. For more gaming news and guides, check out thegamer.com. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.